And then uh, Jim Cox made a statement here. Uh, if we had a barter system and two guys in, in town sold corn, but one said offensive things to you and the other didn't, would you keep buying corn from both or go to the guy who says nothing? This has and, nothing to do with art. It depends on... No, the no, it's about, it's about the, the principle, right? No, it's no, it's not. Principle. It's not. If, you, if, you, if okay. this, this, this comparison doesn't fly, um, because mm. then you would sh you would see the corn as an art, you know. Uh, if one makes a very uh, a cubis cubis cubism art or uh, corn, and the other is making a super realistic uh, corn, you know, uh, they're look looking very different and taste very different. Um, yeah, Fox then it, corn is beautiful from both. So. Yeah, but that doesn't fly because okay. the art is always different from per artist. Mm. Every artist makes their own corn, basically. And every artist, uh, the corn looks differently, tastes differently. And so would you then, even though you would like the corn of the, the offensive bar, uh, barter, he said, way yeah. better if yeah. it, because it's really nice with with sugar on top and kind of coatings and it looks great and it looks shiny. I don't know. And it really tastes good. Even though the, the, the guy who creates is a douchebag, I would buy that corn because ah, damn, it tastes hell nice. I wouldn't okay. buy a mediocre corn just because the, 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 the supplier is, is nicer. Okay. Jim, um, since Roland either doesn't really get it, <laughs> no, or I get it. I, I don't know. I will answer it for you. Um, I I will no longer buy buy corn from the asshole. I will buy corn from the from the nice salesman, and uh, and he gets my business. No, no, I would definitely uh, disagree. Okay. I like the corn of the other one way better. All right, all right. Because it looks better, it tastes better. But I get it because I know I'm in this in this artist world. Um, they don't always look at the style. The my con contractors, you know, people who hire me don't always look at the style. They look what's below the line, how much, how much you cost, and if they if they already know you and you're mm -hmm. already nice to work with, right. then they would hire you again and hire you again and hire you again. Um, if you are somebody who are difficult to work with, even though you have your own unique style, they tend not to hire you that quickly. So I do get it. But for me personally, uh, I would go for the art and not for the artist. Mm. Okay, maybe maybe this 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 analogy is better for you then. Uh, David Feet asks, Roland, would you take the most beautiful art that you love from a guy who spits in your face with every transaction? Well, at some point, the let's say at some point uh, yeah. the uh, how do how would I say it in English? In, in the Netherlands, we say like the bucket is full. <laughs> there are one more drop in the bucket, and the bucket flows. Oh, the no, enough yeah. is enough. Uh, uh, you can only stand shit so many times, and then it would influence you. But that's on the personal interaction. Then you know, 